What's up, everybody? Again, Ken 113 class. Uh, keep killing it. Doing great on um, all the discussion posts and everything with these workouts we're posting. So this one, again, is full body. We're actually going to hammer the upper body a little bit, and then the uh, Bs will be all lower body ex exercises. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is push up with a tap, shoulder tap. So we're just going to come down, push up, tap, push up, tap. You want to make sure your feet are a little wider than your shoulders. So you're not rocking all over the place. You do 16 of those. Next thing we're going to do some floor wipers. So it's the one time we're going to add a little equipment. I think everybody's got a towel that they can use at the house. You're basically just going to put these towels down on the ground. Okay, if you need something like a mat underneath your knees for a pad or whatever, you're just going to put these towels on the ground and see if I can get you. I think you can see now. There we go. Perfect. All right. So I'm over here, over the, putting a little pressure on the towels, and I'm just small circles, wax on, wax off style, Karate Kid. Okay. So I'm going to just do 20 of those forward, and then 20 back. And that's going to really kind of hit your front delts, okay, as well as kind of a little bit of that chest. After that, you're going to do bench dips. Okay, so you can use a chair at your house, whatever it is. Okay, you're just going to set, set the bench up. So you want to make sure hand, uh, wrist is underneath your shoulders. Okay, shoulders black back. Okay, you can slightly bend your knees. And we're just going to bring them down and up, pushing all the way through. Okay, and you're going to do 16 of these bench dips. Making sure as you go forward, you're not letting those shoulders really Kind of internally rotate. Okay, so keep those shoulders back and we're just pressing through our hands, basically making sure the wrist and shoulder is in align, alignment. Okay. Right after that you got dive bombers. Okay, so like a push-up position. We're here and then you're gonna come down and up. Okay, so we're diving down and bringing ourselves back up. So these are dive bombers. You're going to feel it in your shoulders, a little bit in your chest. You're going to do 16 of those. Uh, and then for core, okay, at the end of the A's, we do some alternate sprint, sprinters. Okay, so all opposite touch. So we're here, reach back, here, reach back. Do 16 of those, and we're going right into flutter kicks. I like doing flutters. A lot of times you can do flutters where you put your hands right underneath and do it this way, point the toes out. I like pressing our arms out, all the way out. Press that low back into the ground, almost like a hollow hold. And then we're going to do flutters this way, pressing that low back, low, uh, low back into the ground. We're going to do 16 of those. So those are the A's. We're gonna go through that four times. And then for the B's, we got single leg to a bench or a chair. So we'll start off. We'll go down nice and slow. You can put your hands out if you want, cross your arms however you want it. If you have some weight, you can hold the weight. We're gonna go down with one, up with two. Just focus on the eccentric portion, like a five seconds on the way down. If that's too easy, you can just go touch and go, okay, for 16 of those on each leg. Next thing, one of my favorite exercises, very simple, hamstring walks. Get yourself out on the ground. Okay, and we're going to raise our hips up, hands can be down. You're just going to walk those heels underneath your butt, almost like a hip thrust. And then we're walking our way out, and then back. So we focus on raising those hips. Keep that constant tension on those hamstrings as you walk the heels uh, forward and backwards. Uh, 
do basically five reps of that where you're bringing the feet to you, one and out, okay, bringing them in and out, that's two, do five of those would be great. Next thing we're gonna go, we'll really smash our legs. We're gonna do a lunge hold for 10 seconds. So you're gonna hold this for 10 seconds. Vertical posture, hold it for 10 seconds. Then lunge in place for 20. Put your hands on your waist if you want. If you have a little weight, you can hold some weight. So you're gonna do 20 of those. And then you're gonna do a lunge with a knee drive. Okay, and you're gonna do 10 of those. Okay, so you're not, so you're going basically lunge hold for 10 seconds, then up and down for 20, and then reverse lunge with a knee drive for 10 on the left leg, then you're gonna do the right leg, okay? And then we're almost done with the leg stuff. Then you're gonna go right into a body weight squat, just so squatting down, okay, hold this. And uh, one thing, again, to remind you, these, uh, Toes slightly pointed out, make sure your knees are tracking over your big toes. This will help open up your hips, okay, and keep that vertical posture. Okay, so we're right here, we're gonna squat down, we're just gonna hold this for 10 seconds. Then you're gonna do 10, uh, 20 squats. Put your hands on your head if you want, keep that vertical posture however you want it. You do 20 of those, and then you're gonna do 10 squat jumps. So we're here. Land, and you're gonna do 10 of those. And you're gonna finish with some seesaws for core. Again, using those, using a towel, right? Okay, so just put the towel down. You're gonna go into a middle plank. And I'm just gonna bring forward and back almost like TRX seesaws. Sorry, the power is at 10%. I live on the edge with that uh, uh, phone battery, constant. So again, seesaws, feet are on the, on the towel, and you're just gonna go forward and back. Okay, pressing through that upper back, don't want to be dipping down or dip that lower back. Keep everything nice and tight like someone's going to punch you in the stomach. Braced. You're going forward and back for 16 of those. Right into leg outs. So you don't need the towel. You're in a middle plank position and your legs are just going to go from in to out. So we're just like this. Again, you don't want to dip down, so stay nice and solid. You go 16 of those. Then you go four times through all that. Again, thanks a ton for watching. Hope you guys are having a great day and staying safe.